so I stumbled upon uh, uh, Dr. Shelley Friedman, Scottsdale Institute, and uh, you know they they like they're like pros and hair growth and restoration. And so here's what I've been doing because of them. I researched the world and found that he is the best, and this whole clinic is the best. So just to give you my daily routine. I wake up in the morning. I put like Rogaine in my hair, which is fun actually. It is weird to say this, but it's really fun. I en really enjoy this process. Uh, and then I put in uh, I put in my hair gel and I go throughout my day. And at night when I go to bed, I put in the Rogaine at night. And every other day, I wear this laser cap that covers my whole head. And it's actually pretty comfortable. And I watch TV in or I do conference calls. Or if I go on a long drive, I have the cap on. And it stimulates my hair growth. And uh, so I've been like five, six months. And I have a whole new head of hair. And it's amazing. And you can see the before and after pictures on a website called johnjayshead.com. All right, so, so I was really nervous when I made my appointment, but it was very casual. It's low key. Nobody can see, you can come in privately. You can go in the back. Do they have a back? Do you have a back? Yeah. <laughs> you can come in privately. You can go in the back and, and just have a private consultation. And it was fascinating and it was so interesting. And I left with a bunch, a bunch of information. And then I went and I searched everything online and watched videos of Dr. Friedman and his patients. And I'm in. You got to do this. It's, it's going to change your life. It's going to make you get more confidence you're going to look younger you're going to feel younger people are going to be come up to you all the time say oh yeah you look great what are you doing but they have no idea they think that you're lifting weights you're working out or they have no idea it's your hair you know i'm doing all those things i'm lifting weights i'm working out it is my hair so i don't know if these people are lying to me i don't know who to believe anymore